Hey guys, I'm back for another video and welcome to Space Something Something. Ooh, I just saw that freaking thing right in front of me. There's two creepers. I just placed grout. Oh no, I placed stone on top of this torch. Oh my god. I keep forgetting the name of this hack. No, you stay out of this. He literally fell down there the second the episode started. Yeah, anyway, welcome back. Oh my god. That was a rude awakening. I came back up here for torches last I checked. So let's go make some. Come on. I need some more storage. This is getting ridiculous. Uh, okay, going back down. Eh, I need to store some stuff, free some spots in my inventory. Okay, go back down. Nice. Oh, yeah, torches, put those in the hand. So, our goal is to find some lava so we can fuel our smeltery. Ooh, osmium, I like that. Oh, I just realized we're going to need to find iron to... What the hell is this? What is that? What is that? Okay, there's some weird stone in my way. Oh, I found a... I found a squiddy! Hey, squiddy! How's it going? <laughs> Sorry. I need your stuff. Oh, good. You dropped Kanamati. Okay. So, my goal right now is to find lava. And I think I'm about to find it. So, ooh, so oh, iron. Nice. Right near a lucky block. Because I need three of it to make a bucket. And I just realized in order to actually, like, fuel a smelter, you need lava. But I also just realized that I need the, uh, I need the iron. Okay. So chance cubes are scary. Mm. Welcome back, Seth Bling here. What? Hey! Redstone! Ooh, that's good stuff! Ooh, that's very good stuff! <clears throat> okay. 32 redstone! Oh! That's so good! Ooh, 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 ooh. Nice! Yes, we just got a ton of stuff. Nice! Thank you, Chance Cube, for not killing me. Nice. Seth Bling reference. Nice. Look at all that redstone stuff. I was very scared when I broke that because I'm like, is it going to kill me? Well, now we have the iron to make a bucket, so that's good. We can transport lava. We haven't found it yet, but that's okay. Uh, Alright, let's, let's make ourselves a bigger chest because this is just getting ridiculous. Look at all of the seared brick. Oh, our furnaces are done. Good, I can smelt some copper now. <laughs> Wait, what am I doing? No. I need to smelt the iron. <sighs> Coffee seeds? I don't know why I have those. <laughs> Do we have any one in the chest? Not enough for another chest. Okay. Can I free up any inventory slots? No. Oh, no. This is annoying. Well, at least I'm not dead. Those creepers really scared the crap out of me at the beginning of the episode. Okay. I need to break this tree. I need to use my fist. That moment when your fist is better than the tool you have. Okay. Let's get this party started. Oof. I would like to make some tools. Because right now, this is tough. This pack does not let you just straight up, like, make an iron pick. Like, nah. You gotta go through all the work to get it. Okay. I don't need maple saplings right now. I need a chest to store my things. Okay. Let's make one. Whoop. What just happened? Hey! Don't you do that. It just took me out of my inventory randomly. Okay, now what? Uh, I guess I'm just going to dig this out and put that there so I can have a double chest. Nice. Okay, now I can store my things. <laughs> nice. That's much better. Okay, so now we have all these seared bricks. It's definitely enough for a, a good old shmail tree. Are we done? Nope, we still have that one going. We have four iron ingots, which is nice. Acquire hardware. We can make ourselves a bucket. Nice. The buckets look slightly different in this pack. That's interesting. Okay. 
So let's make 16 seed bricks should be good. I'm going to make a basin. I'm going to make a few drains. We're going to need some glass for what I'm thinking of, actually. Let's um, let's do that as well. Good old sand. Okay. What does this do? I forget. Smelter so controller. Perfect. And then we need two seared tanks as well. I'm going to need one of these. I'm going to need two of these. Nice. Um, honestly, I think that's it. I pretty much made everything. So then if I do this, I'm pretty sure it will make the seared tanks. Perfect. So now I can make a very crude smeltery. I could actually make a pretty decent one since I have all these bricks. So if I go like that, boop. Oh yeah, look at that. Boop, boop. Good. Let's make a smeltery, people. There's all the stuff in my hopper. Good. So where are we building this thing? It's definitely temporary. We're not actually planning on living here for an extended period of time. But just so that, you know what? I'm just gonna make a standard smeltery. Three by three. No big deal. And okay. So let's start off like that. Break this. Boom, boom. And then we take our smeltery drains, put them like that. And then we have a casting basin, casting table, two faucets. And then we gotta put a controller in the front with the tanks. I don't know why I did that just now with that. Okay, so tank, tank, controller. Nice! And now we have a smeltery. I can make it taller as well. I'd like to make it at least a little bit taller. Not wasting these blocks. Don't need to do that. Also, there's sheep here. Interesting. <laughs> Good. I'll make this thing... What am I doing? No corners allowed, Brandon. Get out of here. Ah, don't you do that. Okay. It should be a decent sized smeltery. I could make it a little bit bigger. Just to make my life a bit easier. Nice. Okay. We have a smeltery now. So that's a thing. Um, it would also be nice just to do that. Cool. So now we're going to need to find... Oh, we need gold as well. I didn't even think of that. Crap. Alright, our job's not done here. Eh. So we need lava. I have my bucket now, so that's nice. Might as well... This flint pickaxe is actually not bad. Where's the rest of my flint? Ah. Oh. Flint! Oh, there it is. Okay. So we'll go like this. Flint pick. And a flint shovel. I would like to get some more torches so I can adventure underground a bit farther. There's some more glass. We can use that for crafting later. Some coal. Good. Put that away. I'm going to need some wood for this, too. That should be enough for now. For at least a few torches. 16. Yeah. Okay. I think I am ready to go back down underground. My goal is to get at least a gold ingot and some lava. If I can do that, I can make casts. Two casts, to be exact. <gasps> well, actually, one cast. So, the minimap shows that there's lava over here. So, that is where I intend on going. Also, there's some items that I dropped over here. I don't know if they're still there. Nope, did not. Okay. Sorry, bat. Let me hit you. Ugh, get out of my way, weird stone types. On my way over to the lava. The lava should be, like, right here. So, that's... I hope. I hear it. I hear the lava. I also have a lot of coal nearby. That's good. Hey, lava. It's either right above me or right below me. I'm gonna guess below me because... If it was above me, I probably would see it from the surface. Lava! Where are you? It's underneath this coal vein, probably. Or above me. I don't know. But where are you? I have to dig in like a giant, like... There it is! Nice! Got it. Okay. Let's see if there's anything here. Ooh, is that Basel? Oh, it's banned. It's like, okay, whatever that is. Let's get out of here. We got what we want. Now we can use the smell tree, which is nice. But unfortunately, we don't have an ingot cast, so we can't actually... We know what, though? We don't need an ingot cast. If we have enough of the material, we can just put it in the base and craft the ingots. Ha-ha! We don't need no gold. Oh, but to make the pickaxe, we do. Hmm. Touche, touche. Well, I've learned from last time. I'm not going to risk leaving this open when I sleep. And let's see. <laughs> let's go. Oh, 
Ooh. Hi, right, Creeper. Goodbye, Creeper. Some burning zombies. Thank you for your generous donation, Zombie. Well. Lava. Now we are ready. So, iron. In you go. Ow. Get out of here, buddy. Maybe a flint sword would be pretty good, too. Yeah, let's see what we got with that. The durability is so crap on all these tools. I need to... I'm going to get my copper as well. Where's the copper? There you are. I might need some more lava, actually. So I'm going to quickly go back down and get it. Is it over here? No. I need my lava. I'm going to get a second bucket. Look at all these squids. A lot of wildlife here. <laughs> Boop. And grab some more of that. Good stuff. Ooh, there's osmium again. Not sure what that's needed for, but okay. Only at 9% durability on this thing. New. No. Look at all that molten iron. Ah, uh, so now I can go bloop. Make a block of that. And then I'm going to dump in my copper. Which would be good. Man, I need to get some gold. I don't know how I'm going to. Look at that. I wish we could just craft normal tools, but this game's like, nah, bruh. You got to do it with the smell tree and all that. This is annoying me, so it's going to go. Goodbye. All right, now... I heard a sizzle. Huh. <laughs> Five blocks of copper. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Not sure what I can use it for, but... Uh, I don't know. I can make iridium. Oh, boy. <laughs> Not that kind of iridium, probably. Uh, okay, molten copper. Bam. So, what are the uses for iron blocks? Boop, other than just ingots. Ooh. That sheep scared me. I thought it was approaching me. I can make a tool forge now because I have so much copper. I could just make it out of copper underneath. Uh, let's see. I can make a painting press. I can make iridium blocks again. Iron apple. I can make an anvil. Typewriters. Nah. Not really. Oh. Blocks of copper look weird. Neotech. What are the uses for these? I can make a copper chest. Ooh, that's in this pack okay electric furnace Ooh, i like that oh pam's harvest craft is in this as well you can make a presser a charge meter a basic capacitor that mod's in this all right that means i can make guns as well <laughs> but the issue here is i need to make a pickaxe but i don't have any gold me <laughs> How am I going to make a better pickaxe then? Wait. How's that supposed to work? Is there a type of pickaxe I can make that doesn't use a pickaxe? Do I need pickaxes that aren't Tinker's Tools? A black quartz pickaxe? How do you get black quartz? Whoa. Oh, let me do that. I have an idea. I don't know. Where do you find black quartz? Do I need to go to the nether before I do anything? I'd be kind of surprised if I did have to go to the nether, but at the same time, I don't know. Blue diamonds. I need to find some pallid palladium. I don't know. I, I need to find something. All right, what have we got here? One more block. Boop. No, not, what I, not what I wanted. I've never actually made anything with a basin that requires, like, putting something in the basin first. Well, that's fun. Now I can make the, uh, the lag. Uh-oh. Game. Yeah, there you are. We have to find gold. That That is the thing limiting us right now. I don't know how I'm going to mine it, though, because I bet the mining level of what I'm currently using is not good enough. So I do new. But it will. 
I don't have much other options here, so I'm just gonna have to hope that I find something good. And I really need some torches. This is getting annoying. I want a ton. I'm gonna craft as many as I possibly can right about now. Boop. Boop. Good. Stack and have a torches. This should be more than enough. Okay, let's go. Down below we go. Hopefully you're going to find some gold. I wonder if I can make an osmium pickaxe, actually. Hold on. Ooh, wait, that, that could be a thing. Osmium, osmium ingot, yeah. Osmium pickaxe, hey! All right, yeah, I can. Sweet. I'm gonna find, I need to find more of it though if I wanna get a block's worth. I think I need five ingots of it if I wanna make a block using the smeltery at least because then it gives you double the ore when you smelt it osmium pickaxe is how i'm going to be able to mine the gold because it's the only pickaxe you can literally just craft without using the smeltery or as of now at least it is Ooh, do night i don't know what that is just some weird stuff <laughs> Woo! Uranium. Can't use that yet. I'm not really interested in using it at all, actually. What is that? Prosperity ore. What are you? Prosperity ore. Uses. I can make a prosperity block, an infusion crystal, master infusion crystal. Uh base crafting seed myth oh i don't know what that stuff does but okay it's fine with me more osmium that's aluminum never mind i thought it was osmium there are a lot of ores in this game holy crap <laughs> that's osmium good now i should be able to make the stuff i need but i still need gold so i gotta keep going down ender ore Tin ore. Okay, I can make bronze now. Just fun. Oh, wow, look at that. Yeah, tin and bronze. Or, tin and copper makes bronze, which is a good material. Probably should make my pickaxe out of that instead of copper. That'd be slightly better, I would imagine. And I'm at diamond level. Hello, aluminum. Getting in my way. And uh, uranium. All right. Not finding any gold or caves for that matter. A cave would be pretty nice. Come on. I'm about to hit bedrock. Give me some gold game. Oh, I hit bedrock. Crap. All right, not happening. <laughs> I need to get out of here. I need to repair my stuff. Ugh. I've gone quite a ways and not found what I wanted. This is great. <laughs> Oop, I wonder what, I wonder if this is Earth. Am I on Earth right now? Like, is that the planet I'm on? That'd be cool. I mean, I'd imagine I am. Hmm. Man, that sky is dark. And a boom. Well, I have a bunch of tin, an osmium, a strong mineral that can be found at nearly any height in the world. It is known to have many uses in the construction of machinery. Well, good. Good. Let's smelt up some osmium then. Okay. And it doesn't work in the smelter. Okay, well, pfft, that's fun. Let's put that in here then. If you're gonna be that way. Do I not have coal? I don't have coal. Well, that's actually kind of funny. Don't have coal. Ugh, oh, it's actually really annoying. 
Does that mean I have to go all the way back down there just to get coal? Maybe I can use some flint to fix my pickaxe first. Thank you. Well, back down I go. Might as well dig out the third block so that I can go up and down the stairs a little faster. Ooh, what's that? Oh, iron! <laughs> Hello. Perfect thing to find right about now. That is a lot of coal. <laughs> that is an absolute ton of coal. Holy crap. Look at that. There's so much of this stuff. I, I've got almost a stack of it from one vein. I wouldn't be surprised if it turned out it was just one big like vein that goes across like a mile. And it's just like, I just found that one piece of it. Oh my god, the ores right now. Look at all that tin. I should probably start focusing on other things right about now because... I don't know. I, I just gotta find gold. That's, that's my only thing I need to do right now. So, all this coal is nice, but I'm done. Okay, let's keep going. Inferium ore? What is that? What are you? Some dust. Inferium essence. Okay. Inferium fur furnace. Efficiency plus 15%. That's nice. Prudentium essence. A lot of essence. Infusion crystal again. Ooh. Mythical fertilizer. Okay. Inferium apple. Gives you absorption too. So it's like a golden apple. Yeah. Hmm. Stone seeds. Oh! Oh, so this is like, uh, what's it called? Magical crops. This is like the equivalent of, uh... I don't remember what that stuff is called. But there's this stuff that that mod uses. Okay. I know what this stuff is. The equivalent of. That's good. But seriously, I gotta find a cave. This is getting really bad. I hear mobs walking around over here. And it sounds like they're standing on grass, which is a bit strange considering I'm underground right now. There's Inferium. That's good. Magical crops are always nice. I like that. Gimme. Where is this freaking cave? Wait. I see stuff. Boom. Oh, hi. Well, this is good. Honestly, you could just blow up at this point. What the hell is this? Fight each other, please. Oh, good. This one in the armor is obviously going to win. Dead. The hell is this? Look at this freaking place. What? What is that? <laughs> There's trees and flowers and grass and what? What is this? Lead ore, okay. Lead, um, more le uh, lead, silver, okay. What is this? This is not a cave. Are you kidding me? Ah, not what I wanted, but it's still cool. But I don't. It's not what I. Whoa, rock formation, a stalactite, or is that a stalagmite? I think that's a stalactite. It's one coming out of the ceiling. I don't know. I I could be wrong. I don't know. Anyway, I need to continue on with my search here so I could potentially find an actual cave instead of just whatever the hell this is. This freaking weird cavern. Okay, let's keep going. I'm just gonna use the minimap to my advantage. I see more mobs underground. <gasps> Black quartz! Ooh, I can use that to make tools! 
My inventory's full. Get out of there, flower. I like black quartz. Good stuff. This is getting ridiculous. This is getting absolutely ridiculous. I can't find what I want. Alright, you know what? There's some water and lava over this way on the map, so I'm going this way. And I'm out of torches. Oh, some granite there. Come on, game. Oh my god. Ah. Alright, fine, I'm going back. Alright, well that's it for this episode, guys. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed that. Oh, excuse my burps. And this is hard. I've been searching on the ground <sighs> for a long time. And I can't stop yawning. And I can't find a cave for the life of me. I can't find a freaking cave. I don't even know what this is. What is this? How do I get out of here? I know there's an explosion somewhere. I need to find the way I came from. Here we go. All right. Whoo. So I need to find, I'm still on the quest for gold so I can make better tools. And I've been finding a lot of stuff along the way. And I, I can't, I can't find anything. So I'm thinking I take a quick break and I look for caves on the surface or something. Cause that'd be fun. But anyway, that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later.